All right, guys, here is another quick tip. This tip in Cricut Design Space is in regards to your height and width proportions. So we're gonna talk about the lock fe feature. So let's say we insert an image. So I'm going to go on the left-hand side and click on images. And I am going to select girl. And I'm just gonna insert any image in here. It doesn't have to be anything special. So we're gonna put insert image and we get this image here. So you'll notice in the bottom left corner of the image, you have a lock and it's locked. If you look right up under untitled, which would be the name of your project, but right now mine says untitled because I haven't named or saved this project. So right up under untitled, or if you've saved your product project, the name of your, the title of your project, you're going to see also a size that has a W for your width, and then it has a lock in the middle, and then it has an H for the height, okay? So <clears throat> if you click the X in the bottom left of the picture, if you click that lock one time, it's going to unlock this image so that you can use this um, arrow feature on the right, the left, right, up, down arrow feature. You could drag that and it would change the sizing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate this image so I can show you the difference. So I'm going to do one where I unlock and one where I drag it without um, unlocking it. Mm -hmm. So if I take and unlock this image as I've done, let me move this over a little bit. If I um, click on the left, right, up, down arrow and drag it, notice it distorts the proportion to height, okay? So she looks a little thin on the right side. Looks like she's, you know, uh, had a nice Memorial Day, gained a little weight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this second image locked and I'm going to use the um, up and down arrow on the right of the image. And notice that I increased the size, but the height and width proportions stayed proportionate, okay? It did not distort my picture. So that's the difference or my image. That's the difference between unlocking and locking, okay? So there are some times that you may wanna go against the grain and change the proportions. And if you wanna do that, then you just make sure that you unlock it. You can either drag it using the arrows or you can go directly to the width and height fields and type directly in them, okay? But if you wanna ensure that your image or whatever you're working with is proportionate to height, then you want to make sure you leave that lock locked, okay? So that is how you can actually um, keep your image together, all right? So that is how to use the width and height measurements or proportions within Cricut Design Space and the difference between unlocking the um, feature or leaving it locked when you need to resize it. All right, have a great day, guys.